Welcome to Sundult, our small scale farm nearby Ullared in the west coast of Sweden. Something funny is going on because I'm doing the introduction in English. Why? You will soon find out. Last uh, weekend we was in Richdale in Värmland in Sweden for a uh, training. Uh, we were supposed to meet uh, Joel Salatin at Richard Perkins farm in uh, Richdale, but uh, Joel didn't uh, get on the plane to Sweden, so we have uh, so we did another type of training. At this uh, training, we Hanna and me was able to present uh, the Sukhens Farmana, our neighbor company, so to speak, a cooperation where we have some highland cattles together using our lands. And uh, we also, in the same presentation, presented Sundult, which is our small scale farm. This uh, presentation was filmed by Tomasz from Poland, uh, but he missed a little bit in the beginning, so I will uh, catch up on that slide now, I think. The first slide presented uh, our logotypes, Sundhult and Sulkens Pharma. Uh, one thing is that uh, Sulkens Pharma means uh, sunshine farmers. It's wordplay with the word uh, moonlightning where you manage the farm during the night uh, underneath the moonlight. But in Solskjens Farmana we wanted something different. We wanted to do it during the day, underneath the sunshine, and also have uh, some uh, happy mind, sunshine in our minds as well. And that's why we choose the name Solskjens Farmana, the sunshine farmers. Our farm is situated in the southwest of Sweden. Uh, you can see it here in the map. This map is a representation of the rainfall during last year. And if you look carefully, you can see there is a dark blue uh, mark where we live, where we have our farms. We got almost 1600 millimeters of rain last year. So we had a quite wet, uh, circumstance to do our farming in. Here is an aerial photo of uh, Sundhult, our small scale farm. You can see the market garden to the left and some fields and we have a old uh, stable where it has been pigs in and uh, this is a family farm that has been in uh, Hannah's family for over 300 years. So we have a quite a heritage to take care of. Here you can see a bunch of members uh, in Sukhens Farmana. We are standing outside our house that uh, Sukhens Farmana owns. We have our farm shop, Victor's Affairs House, Victor's shop in this house. And in the upper level of the house, we have uh, a B&B that we share the workload of having it open. Everyone in uh, Sokens Pharma has different backgrounds. There are engineers, architects, and so on. We are all in different ages in uh, Sokens Pharma, giving us different perspectives, and uh, we have different passions and complementing each other in what we want to achieve and doing with our enterprise. What we would like to achieve wasn't clear from the start, but we did write a manifest, which now has been converted to our holistic context because that was just what we wrote in our manifest, both feet on the ground, we called it. We started our enterprise with having Highland cattle. We didn't know exactly what to do, but we soon found out this thing called regenerative agriculture. From that day, we have more and more and more adapt to achieve what is stated in the regenerative agriculture movement. 
and and he's now he's he's very into this uh, soil stuff. Uh, so, oh, a whole new world. Uh, so uh, it's it's really fun. Uh, we have uh, yeah, it's uh, so one thing that we think is really funny. Who is it that says that Highland cattle are not cows but big dogs? They're registered no. as game, aren't they? Sorry? Are they registered as like game animals as no. opposed to. No, it's, it's the same. Because uh, we. Who's that forestry guy? He has not here in Sweden. Yes, he is in Sweden. He, he has Highland cattle and he can slaughter them at a, a wild game place because they are not in the same category as. We have the same rules. We have, we have this. Uh, he has something different. His name's Martin. He's a, a like forestry guy, quite well known in Sweden. So he, he met Martin. It's Mikael's associate. Um, it's the I never, older I guy that knows more about forestry, but he has Highland cattle and he can home slaughter like in a game slaughter because they're Highland cattle. Never heard of it. But we have been. We have. We are uh, treated the same yeah. way. Uh, so, so we are when we are moving uh, the animals between this this pasture with pastures, we can walk um, two twenty no two kilometers or two or three kilometers the, the longest way. Uh, so we have one 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 in, in the first and uh, come on let's go and then they they know where to go. Uh, so and, and someone. Uh, Behind it can be that the cops are shaking the forest, but they they just uh, go back again. Mm. But we think this is uh, this is valuable time. It's nice. Mm. You 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 walk okay. It, it takes some time, but you you it, it's uh, we are often more people that we than we need to because we like it. <laughs> it's it's just. How often do you move them? Uh, between pastures yeah. or, or, or in the pastures? Yeah, you have yeah. the every pasture in. We have, it's, it's different. Yeah. Uh, at our home this year, we are, are uh, moving like third every Friday. Uh, every Friday. Yeah. Uh, but in, uh, in the top of the, I think we have maybe five, maybe five days or, and Bit, little bit different on how the land looks. Uh, so when when um, it's easy to make this different, uh, because we have no, it, it's never square or never it, it's it's stones, no. stones, 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 <laughs> and uh, everything. Do you have no? Do you have no rocks here? No, they moved them out the field. <laughs> <laughs> We have lots of stones and rocks, and uh, so it depends on how it. Uh, um, and we have them outside <laughs> all the years, and all, all uh, year round. No shelter. Uh, sorry. No. 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 No, bit, no, bit no other. No other shelter than, than the forest. But you see, they they have no not. Uh, it's it's not any long way to the forest. Uh, so this is I uh, guess. Uh, one month or two until uh, she will go to give birth. Mm -hmm. um, oh, she's, she's pregnant. Yeah, she's pregnant. <laughs> she's, uh, her name is Margareta. Oh. Oh. Like one of our uh, members. <laughs> <laughs> Are all of them named after members? No, we, we start, uh, they had started. So uh, the name, uh, this name was already there when, when we go there. But then we have had uh, different. Uh, the first year we had uh, names from Astrid Lindgren's books. Mm -hmm. So we have Ronja, Madiken, Pippi. Oh. Uh, and the next year we had Harry Potter. No. <laughs> so we have uh, <laughs> uh, Vinny and Ron and Hermione, Hermione the cow. Yeah, yeah but Hermione yeah. dead. No. Oh. Oh. Uh, it's, it was very sad. Oh. So, the, uh, but, yeah, it happens, but 
And this is Star Trek. Yeah, Star Trek. <laughs> so now we have the, yeah, we have a little Spock here. Do you, do you see him? <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. there's. Oh. So you change their name every year? No. no. <laughs> the cross that are born this year, they are named after Star Trek. And oh, the, the ones that are I thought you changed the names of all of them. No, no, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> it depends on which year they are. They are yeah. It's first What's name, next middle year gonna name, be? last name. I don't know. Game what do you think? Yeah. Yeah. But we don't like it. We haven't never seen Lord of the Rings. Get a Frodo. Yeah, yeah, Lord of the Rings. Lord of the Rings? Yeah. I think you should go so here. We have uh, this uh, the, perennial, the perennial fans and the mobile fans. I think you should call them George, two of the cars, and, uh, George and Harold. In the winter. <laughs> no reason. We, this is a, a field where we, we take uh, uh, hay in the summer to feed the animals in the winter. Uh, so during the winter, we, uh, oh. <laughs> we get them the hay in... in um, Stricted way, so we, we go through the field uh, each day. We move a little bit, mm -hmm. so we get uh, even distributed. Even distributed uh, the, yeah, complete field. Yeah. Many. Have you considered uh, what uh, Thomas is doing? Just leaving the the hay bales, uh, Yeah, we are we are considering doing in in another uh, because this is how we do it in in our farm. Mm -hmm. But in another farm with our neighbor, uh, he takes care of the, the bigger flock, the cows and uh, the bulls. And he's driving out uh, bales with the tractor. Uh, but then we have talked about leaving the bales and, uh, and not, because now we have used uh, this uh, uh, I don't know the name, uh, okay. where you put the, mm -hmm. the bale in, in uh, construction and they eat. Um, uh, but this little time it takes to to move, it it uh, oh I don't do it today, I wait to the next time, and then you you get this ring where they they stand and uh, and poop. So and and then uh, you have it's not so good distributed because uh, it's too easy to think I move it the next time. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's what we, we thought of changing uh, and testing. But we, we, we test from, uh, we have, it's... We, we do different types, testing our work works at our places and different fields and so on. We are, we are still learning. Right. So this is from the winter of two, it's not this winter, no. it's a winter of four. And uh, then the, the last summer we had uh, Eggmobile, Eggmobile on this field and uh, they were uh, on the same field this winter. Yeah, yeah. and the cow. And, and, and to, uh, this year when we, when, when we uh, cut the hay, uh, we got twice the amount mm -hmm. than last year. Wow. It was a little bit uh, later uh, that we cut it, so it, it's uh, a little Depending on that, but it was really changing. Uh, we, we cut the hay uh, only once, okay. yeah, and then we uh, on this field, yeah. on this field. Yeah. and then uh, now uh, we will take one. I think it will be just one time we take the, the cattle, uh, the and the hens before, uh, or we only. Uh, and when it's time, uh, we, for slaughtering, we, we drive uh, them, uh, me or the neighbor, drive them, uh, so we know that everything, they, they, they go in, in, in a wagon where they can see the nature and small so it's it's 30 kilometers away from from our home um, and it's a little small farm story they started at just uh, smaller uh, sheeps because they have sheeps that, uh, on their own 
uh, but then they they uh, started to because they had their own Highland cattle, so they applied for uh, slaughter also. Cattle. Because in, in, in most of the slaughter in, in Sweden, uh, you will pay extra for the horns. If the animals have, have, have horns, you, I think in, in most of the story it's, it's about uh, 160. That means we have 10 minutes left. Yeah. <laughs> like the, the, if we could just not do questions if we yeah. don't have 10 minutes. Uh, we can move on to our egg movie. <laughs> uh, we wanted, uh, since the, you can see it from the road, we wanted that it uh, should look nice. <laughs> like like yeah. a Swedish yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't want to, to say that your, yours not nice, but uh, I think it's my nice. <laughs> okay, <what>? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So, so we, we thought, wh why not make it red? Uh, and uh, <laughs> it's it's a it's a lot uh, narrow, narrow, narrow. Because we have uh, much narrow gates uh, to our uh, natural gates with uh, yeah, it's rocks and uh, and and stuff, so you don't move them so easy. Uh, so it's two and a half meters, I think. Uh, and we have made it. Uh, so high that we can walk in without bending. So we can walk in and pick the, the eggs uh, without bending or or uh, the head. Uh, yeah. Uh, that's where they are uh, right now. Where they are here right now. Uh, it looks like like dead grass, but it's moss. So they have scratched up all the moss, so it, it's just, uh, and you can see here, the, the grass is coming through the, the moss, uh, they started here. <coughs> Something that when we started, we, we bought, okay, it's uh, supposed to be 50 meters. You should have two, two uh, 50 meters smells, okay, let's buy it. <laughs> uh, but it's, it's too heavy for me to, to uh, make it easy and fast, and I can't have it in my, uh, my hand. So uh, when I saw, oh, you can buy 25 meters instead, let's, let's, let's test it. So now we have bought, uh, so now we are, are using the 50 meters for, for uh, different things, uh, and have uh, 25 meters. Uh, and it's so nice because now it's not not an issue to move uh, the hand, and it's it's very easy when you do this this square on a pasture. If you don't have this tree line, it, it's easy. I just walk the whole uh, the whole fence. Okay, now it ends. I move the other way. So it has been much much faster. Uh, do you want to talk about that? That's a solar panel built of uh, standard components from Swedish retailer, Klaus Olsson Shell Company, where you can get the regulator for the solar panel, and the solar panel is uh, bought there. And the, the box here is uh, for fishing, ice fishing. Uh, so when you open, you have a, a compartment in the bottom where we put the uh, the battery, yes. battery, car battery, and there is a standard uh, energizer that works with 12 volts, and uh, you can put it in a wall socket as well. And in this upper, there is an upper shelf for um, where they keep. Uh, I don't know what when they are fishing. We are, we are not fishing, <laughs> <laughs> but there is the regulator and so on, so you can open the. Uh, firstly, then uh, press the button to turn off the on-off switch. Yeah. For that. What we also have is a gate, which is very practical. You just lift the uh, handle and you can walk in. Yeah, I think it's one point one meter. I think it's, it's, it's quite big yeah, and it's yeah. fast and easy. And we don't we don't need to turn the energizer off. 
Okay. And it's really nice because I'm now when we are here, our kids are, are doing the, the the egg collection, and uh, then it's really nice that they can open the gate and they don't because they they are just out. Yeah, no, it's just twelve. But <laughs> uh, now now she can do the, the egg collection. Uh, no problem. But do you only run twelve volts on the electricity? No, 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 it's 12. Uh, it's a power supply. Uh, yeah. 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 <laughs> Joe, uh, I think it's four and a half, maybe. Joe's. I think. Yeah. Joe's. Yeah. I think. Uh, one other thing. When we, when we were building the egg co collection, it was near a divorce. It was me. <laughs> we are both engineers. And we're, no, 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 that's not the best solution. Yeah, let's do it this way. No, let's do it this way. And we had this time pressure. Oh, the hands are coming next to week. Uh, yeah. And we were struggling with, with how to construct the, uh, the, the, the gates for the, the hands not to go in. On, in the next. Yeah, yeah, on the night. And how we were supposed to fix that they were, they were going to sit and poop. On the on the thing during the night, we don't want something to clean uh, every now and then. How should we? So it was just oh, we need something fast. The hands are already here. Uh, just just put it up some. Everybody had the thing. Tarp. 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 Yeah. And then we, this is the solution. We we don't need those. We just on the, in the morning. I, I had just, it just uh, <coughs> a curtain. Yeah, it squeezed uh, behind the uh, egg moving. So it, it's no, it's no, uh, uh, yeah. Opening so, up. No, no. So we just, uh, that and then, uh, and then, uh, yeah, in the evening when I collect the eggs. And just, uh, and in the morning, I just take this one and do like this. <laughs> and the poop are, are falling down. And I'm uh, folding. Uh, very easy, not not fancy at all. So easy, and then we struggled several days. So yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, we are selling most of our stuff at Rico. Here we were testing how many eggs you can get into a Tesla. <laughs> uh, Two thousand eggs you can <laughs> if you have it in this kind uh, of uh, We are not the only one. Uh, <laughs> we have one customer that saw, oh, there is a Tesla there. Yeah. I'm going to buy from them. He, he <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, I change. I don't buy their eggs anymore. I buy yours because you don't Tesla. <laughs> uh, but we have very different uh, rules on the different recordings. Uh, in this recording, they want us to have signs. Because it's our own admin, uh, and, and this recording, we are not allowed to have songs. So it's it's different, and you have to uh, adapt. That's and so stupid. How do they find you? Like the customers, you, you can't. Yeah, we have we're allowed to have a little yeah. little, <laughs> little sign on the, okay. the on the car. But, okay. yeah. but they know you. Like yeah. once yeah. they yeah. meet you, once yeah. they yeah. don't meet yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. You should brand yeah. your car. Uh, so, uh, and we also uh, sell in our farm shop, is that the which farm is, shop? You, yeah. yeah, this is the farm oh, shop. Yeah. Uh, so this is the, it, it's in the, in the house where the old uh, shop in the last century was. So this is Victor, which is, uh, this is where it is called Victor mm -hmm. uh -huh. Um the Victor shop. Uh, so we have his his scale. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. and, uh, he opened the, the, the shop in 1924 to 1963. And we have an original interior from yeah. him. Yeah. 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 So the meat we are, are selling uh, in details. We don't sell uh, boxes. We, we sell uh, yeah, cups. Yeah. <laughs> and if it's some cups that are not uh, so... Um, Popular. popular, yeah, popular, yeah. We we we, uh, for example, we we let another company smoke uh, some of the cuts, uh, and then they are popular. <laughs> so you have to adapt in that way. Also. We have done uh, some infrastructure or lots of in infrastructure the last year. We have we build the we have the same tunnel as as here, but it's 
this is 6.2 meters times uh, 22, 22 meters. I don't uh, remember the foot. Uh. And, uh, and we uh, have installed a second hand chiller uh, in the old. Uh, Barn? Mm -hmm. No, the barn. Stable. Stable. Pig stable? Do you say that? Yeah. No. Yeah? My, my, my parents had, had the pigs uh, before. Uh, and this is our uh, start of the uh, market garden. Here's a, a little egg mobile. Okay, so they, they are working with this area we are going to use next year. I need to. Time's up, huh? Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, the best buy. <laughs> we, we love our wood chip. I just wanted to say that. <laughs> uh, we think it's great to, if, if you have uh, chopped the trees and uh, for a uh, wood. Fire, 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 yeah. Yeah. And we have forests uh, and, and you go out at the perimeter of the fields and yes. cut the trees. I think it cost us thirty thousand. I'm not sure. Three thousand uh, euros for that one, and it uh, it uh, chops up to twenty one centimeters. Everyone should have a What do you chip the trees up there? Just for fun? Is it for the garden? Yeah, just for fun? No, we bought it for the garden. You should do And also to the tarp and the tarp. For better. Super nice. Thank you for watching this video. It, we had a magnificent uh, week uh, at uh, Richdale uh, and really a crash course in small scale farming and different enterprises. And one important thing for, for me, at least, was to meet different uh, farmers from all over Europe, Czechia, Poland, Portugal, England, Ireland, Norway and so on, and of course Sweden as well. We had the opportunity to listen to a few different stories about different farms during the nights at the, this training. Uh, this channel is in Swedish, so if you have any people you know that speak Swedish, get them to our channel and we will talk more about small-scale farming and spread the word of regenerative agriculture there. See you!